I am Ryan Dick, and I have been uh, a Christian my whole life, but I didn't really make my faith my own until I went to a camp, and that's when I fully committed my life to Christ. Well, going into this year, uh, it was the end of my junior year, going to my senior year, I was kind of, you know, really hoping to maybe, you know, commit to a college, do some more college visits, take standardized testing, see where I can, you know, measure up kind of find out what I really like and what I want to do for the rest of my life. When everything shut down, it made it really hard to visit colleges and take those tests, but it ended up being better than what I expected because I really found out more about myself and made some really good friends and connections and really found into what I like to do and in the experience I learned more about who God is and I got to read more devotionals and kind of spiritual books, uh, which is really helpful for building my faith. Just with everything I did, um, even down to the friendships I made, uh, it seems like God has always opened doors for me to different like activities or jobs or stuff even at church, um, being on like the landscaping team and the video editing team, it just gives me so many opportunities and I think that's all stuff that's really cool and, and from God is just opportunities to help not only build my interests but build my faith and be around good uh, Christian mentors. It kind of shaped my my world view, I would say. It helped me understand um, the perspectives of more people and um, get around more, you know, get to see what people like and what people don't like and be able to build friendships and, you know, like people like Pastor Pastor John and John Iacucci, Pastor Steve, um, they really helped show me what it's like to be a, a man of Christ. Definitely if I uh, wasn't a Christian, I would be a lot more anxious. Um, and probably a lot more fearful um, with even just how our things are in the world because um, I wouldn't really know where to build my like life upon. Um, but with God, you get that sense of trust and that he's always with you even through the hard times and that even relating to Ephesians 3.20, um, he just takes, takes you from where you are to things that you wouldn't even you know, imagine that could happen in your life. I think it's really important to make your faith your own. I've learned from experience that if you base your faith on how your favorite pastor or uh, your favorite author bases their faith on it could be kind of rocky and shaky if they're going through a tough time but if you make it your own um, it just kind of gives you that your own like sense of of trust and hope in in God and what he can do with your life. I like to look far ahead to the future and I know that with God he has like he already knows what college I'm going to go to he already knows what I'm going to do for the rest of my life. He already knows everything about me, so there's no need to worry. So I just, you know, trust in him and I make that my own. Friendships he's given me, definitely. It's helped me, definitely helped me grow my life and, and people to go to when I'm having a hard time and just, um, you know, knowing real Christian guys and girls that can help me uh, move my faith forward and just keep growing.